So we are almost done, but we only need to learn one more uh, CLI command, and this is to clean up the entire project, and that is the delete table command. So we're gonna go ahead and delete our table. Now we could just go in here uh, and hit delete table, but that's not fun. Let's use the CLI. So we're gonna go delete table, and we'll look at the example. I think it's just as simple as that. Yeah, it's that simple. If you delete through here, it would ask you to like, maybe you might wanna back it up. We do not want to back this table up. We want it gone. And I'm gonna type it in Starships here, and we'll hit enter there. And now you can see that it is deleting. If we wanna get an update, uh, we can go over here and see that it is deleting. Might already be gone. Oh, it's already gone. And if it was taking time to delete, we could use the describe command to give it a look here. And we can see that nothing is being returned because there is no longer a table. So there you go, that is the DynamoDB run through. Um, if you have more time on your own, you might want to try to set up a DynamoDB stream. Um, and those are kind of interesting to see. I'm just gonna type in Starships again here. You don't, you don't have to do any of this, I'm just going through it just so I can show you DynamoDB streams here. Ship class, uh, registry. So DynamoDB streams, once this table creates, we'll give it a second. If you want to set those up, it's under under triggers. You create a trigger, you'd create a existing function. Um, and the idea here is whenever new records come into the database, it will call that, um, that Lambda function. And then from that Lambda function, you can then send it to wherever you want. Generally, you'd send it to Kinesis Firehose or some Kinesis service. But that's just a way to react to data in here. But yeah, this is outside the scope of the developer associate. It's uh, kind of a stretch goal uh, if you want a little personal project to do. But our table is deleted. I'm just going to go delete it here. And you can see that it says create a backup before deleting. We're not going to do that. Um, but yeah, that's DynamoDB there. So there you go.